Results, meanwhile, from the Business Roundtable CEO Economics Outlook Survey coming out right now. Let's get to Kayla Tausche in Washington for the latest read. Kayla. Well, Sarah, the outlook from the corner office dimmed this quarter, according to the Business Roundtable, with CEOs of major multinational companies less optimistic about hiring plans, capital investments, and sales for the next six months. All three of those metrics are down from the first quarter, though expectations for GDP remained intact, and the expectations are still above historical averages and recession levels. 127 CEOs completed this survey in the two weeks that ended Monday, June 3rd. It was called a turbulent few weeks for U.S. trade relations by the Business Roundtable CEO Josh Bolton, who said uncertainty over trade policy is making it more difficult for companies to invest and operate confidently. BRT members have overwhelmingly voiced their support for free trade and resolving some of these outstanding disputes. But President Trump has said BRT's peer, the Chamber of Commerce, is only focused on the interests of its members, not the country, because we could see a broader economic impact if this outlook plays out in things like hiring. I was just wondering if it sort of coincides with that weaker jobs report that we got last month, as there are a lot of questions about whether that was driven by trade uncertainty or just a tight labor market and a low supply of workers. Well, I think the differentiation is the jobs report is backward looking. This survey is forward looking. So this is how executives feel about the next six months. And would be interesting to see this survey taken again with that Mexico deal actually notched yeah. to see if that, in fact, was the cloud that was hanging over this. Mm. Kayla, thank you. Sure. Small business sentiment yesterday was, was positive. This is bigger companies that tend to be more internationally exposed versus smaller companies, more U.S. focused, perhaps. And, uh, and more political, them. too.